reasons uh, Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu has advented and by understanding the personality of Mahaprabhu then we can enter something of this uh, Braj Leela that our Gurudev is bestowing this mercy on us to understand through so many years and so many teachings that he wants us to comprehend these topics that um, this uh, uh, Anaya Radito Bhagavan so understanding the uh, what is this Braja Prem that can only be uh, understood through the mercy of uh, Gurudev teaching us who is the personality of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and to understand that we, we must take this process from Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, this Hari Nam Sankirtan, this Hari Nam Hari Nam Hari Nameva Kevalam Kalona Steva Nasteva Gatiya Anyata, that to understand the glories of the chanting of the Holy Name and to practice this diligently. So all the we have been listening tonight to so many wonderful um, uh, inspirations to carry with us when we leave this down of the glories of uh, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and his Dham and, and what can we carry this Hari Nam in our hearts Thank you. and glory to Gurudev. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Krishnaya Krishna Bhaktaya Radha Bhaktaya Namo Namaha 73 years ago on this very same night the evening before the appearance of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu Nityalila Pravishta Om Vishnu Pad Paramahansa Jagat Guru Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Thakur Srila Prabhupada gave a most amazing revelation of the important the import of the first verse of Sri Gita Govinda in that lecture the verse describes evening has come and dark clouds have covered the moon and Radha's friend is telling her please take Krishna he's very shy take him to your grahini to your kunj and the, this scene, Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Thakur says reveals the esoteric meaning of the appearance of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Said these clouds, they are like the dark clouds of atheism in Kali Yuga, the dark clouds of ignorance, of impersonalism and atheism. Some people even thought, in, due to the influence of atheism, that Krishna was very puffed up to say that oh sarva dharmam prachaja mam me kam saranam braja to surrender to me and I am the lord of all beings and I am the enjoyer of all sacrifices he said scholars and pendants thought oh Krishna has become very puffed up so in this incarnation Krishna becomes timid he said in this incarnation Krishna becomes very humble and meek. He comes as Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, not to uh, defeat the atheists and impersonalists by arguments, but to soften their hearts and win them over by the power of his brain and his humility, like he did with Prakashananda Saraswati and his 60,000 disciples in Varanasi. Also, uh, he describes that this Chaitanya Mahaprabhu he is the union of Radha Madhava. So to understand Radha Madhava is a very uh, mysterious thing as we have heard tonight. But now in this first verse of Sri Gita Govinda, the meaning of Radha Madhava is revealed. So Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Thakur, he came at a time when great clouds of ignorance had also had befallen Vaishnavism. 
people were interpreting the script, the highest scriptures in the most obscene ways and drawing the most lurid meanings. And even scholars are bewildered to understand the proper conception of the highest and purest love. So Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati very strictly established the proper path and etiquette of all Vaishnavas. And here at Sridhar Mayapur he established the yoga pit of uh, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu for, as a beacon to the whole world what is the pure conception and true love of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. And my Diksha Guru, Nityalila Pravishta Om Vishnupad, Srila Bhakti Vedanta Swami Prabhupada, he also established in Sridham Mayapur, Sri Gore with Radha Madhava. This was very significant. It was the only temple that he established exactly in the same line as his Guru Maharaj. Sri Gore and Radha Madhava. And he spread the glories of Radha Madhava. Jaya Radha Madhava Kunja Bihari all over the world, before every Bhagavatam class, he revealed more about Radha Madhava. But still we couldn't understand. People are thinking that if we have very big temples and very big deities, that this makes uh, the uh, mission of Chaitanya Mahu progress forward. But actually, it's not how big our deities or temples are, it's how big our conception is. And now, to help clear up to help clear up the misunderstanding, I have heard some Acharya speaking that, oh, uh, you cannot do Raga Nuga Bhakti. That is only for crazy people. This is uh, completely shocking because Lord Chaitanya gave to give this gift. This is the internal reason. Everything has external reason and internal reason. And we need to be balanced. We need to do and know both. What was the external mission of Lord Chaitanya? To preach, to spread Sankirtan Harinam to all the general masses of people and books that they can understand. But also we should understand the internal meaning. When that becomes lost, when those clouds again of doubt and of ignorance and of confusion come in, now Srila Gurudev has given Sri Geet Govinda and the internal meaning of Radha Madhava. In the first verse you will read, he describes who Madhava, who Radha are. And through that whole book you will come to understand what is Lord Chaitanya's pure love. Thank you Srila Gurudev for this gift. Om Ajnana Tamarandasya Gyananjana Salakaya Chakshuru Militam Jaina Tasmai Sri Gurave Namaha <clears throat> I'm very lucky to be here with you all. Uh, some weeks ago, Srila Gurudev called me on the telephone just at a time when I was having many uh, practical problems with my material life and <clears throat> somehow or another because Gurudev is uh, understanding what's in all of our hearts uh, no matter where we are uh, he understood that I was having these difficulties and he we talked on the telephone and he started out the conversation by saying Krishna has a special relationship with the jivas because he likes to put them into difficulty and sometimes great difficulty uh, only to wait until the very last minute before he comes along and saves them. Of course in my mind I thought that the last minute had passed about two months before. <laughs> but. He said, the most important thing is to always have faith that no matter what happens, Krishna will come to save the devotee. He always comes to save the devotee. A couple weeks later, I had another phone call with him and he asked how everything was and I said, more or less everything is the same way 
and he said, well, are you coming to Navadvi? And I said, well, Gurudev, you know, things are very difficult. And, uh, and he said, I want you to come. You must come. He said, if you come, one particle of dust in Navadvi can give you Krishna Prema. So I was quite taken by that. And he said, and who is going to do all my astrology for me? And I started laughing, and he also started laughing. And so that made me think, oh, this is something special. So some of you know that I've told some that tomorrow is a very, very special day. And. It is a very special day. It's very unique for all of us who are lucky to be here because Srila Gurudev being the representative of, of Ni Thai, he's going from place to place, from village to village, house to house. He's even using the telephone and the internet to call us and say, come with me, leave these things that you think are so important. Leave these false identities that you've given so much attachment to and so much energy to and that you think, oh, if I'm not there, everything will fall apart. Leave all of that behind because these things are illusion. And come with me and taste Navadvip Dham. Taste something of this holy name of Krishna. So, we're all very lucky to be brought here, to be inspired by Srila Gurudev, and I'm very grateful that he's uh, made a special effort to drag me here. Haribo! Haribo! I'm very happy that he's made a special effort to, to drag me here. This, other speakers have also talked about this falling down of the Pandal. I think it's very <clears throat> symbolic, as so many have already said, that this great uh, pralaya that appeared from nowhere and which blew away our shelter, this is just like our material bodies. And at any moment our material bodies can end, and usually in very unpleasant ways. We have to be prepared for these things, and the only way that we can be prepared for them is by associating with a sadhu and hearing Hari Kata. I believe that the storm is symbolic of clearing away so many anarthas that will, or that have blocked our ability to hear Hari Kata, our ability to serve <laughs> our Gurudev. At the end of the day, he's all we have. We have nothing else. So I beg you, Rene, please keep me at this lotus feet. Bunch of Kopa I don't know what pronouns to Srila Gurudev, all the Vaishnavas present. And I'm very happy to be here. I wasn't expecting to come this year. Gurudev also asked me personally, which he's never done before. Um, and uh, I, I had some realization today as to the benediction that 
I may receive and many of us may receive by coming to the Holy Dhamma. At every step, it is said in the scriptures that one can gain the benefit of 10 million Ashvamedha Yagnas by doing Parikram every step. By one day in Navadvip Dham is equal to one year in many of the other holy Dhams. So there's so many material benedictions that may come. And the five personalities of liberation, Sarsti, Smisti, Salokya, Sarupya, and Sayuja are waiting to give the pilgrims benedictions. And many may take these benedictions. But Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's teaching is something different. Nadanam Najanam Nasundarim Kavitam Ba Jagadisha Kamaye Mamajan Mani Jan Mani Ishware Bhavatar Bhaktir Ahaituki Kai. Oh my Lord, I do not desire wealth. Nadanam Najanam Nasundarim. I do not desire association with beautiful persons in this world of the opposite sex. Kavitam. Nadanam Najanam Nasundarim Kavitam ja, Na Jagadisha Kamae or the beautiful poetry of the Vedas. But Mama Janmani Ishvari Babata Bhaktir Ahaituki Tai only unmotivated, pure devotional service at your lotus feet. So if Nityananda Prabhu and Mahaprabhu are merciful to us and shower their mercy on us and give us the benediction for our austerities coming here, hearing Harikata, associating, hearing the Tattva, hearing the Lila. And they sprinkle their mercy on us. Then we may realize what is pure bhakti and begin to tread on this path of Shuddha Bhakti. Anyabilashita sunyam jnana karmadiya navitam anukulyena krishna rushidanam bhakti rupa. And realize the purport of all the very high philosophical teachings. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's teaching is the culmination of many, many thousands of years of the development of theism in India, beginning with Lord Buddha, Sankracharya, Ramanujacharya, Madhvacharya, Vishnu Swami, and Nimbaditya Acharya. All the different sampradayas are leading up to the advent of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu who took the essence from each of the sampradayas, two principles from each, and culminated them all together to give the highest conception of theism ever presented. Achintya Veda Veda Tattva. So we are very fortunate to be in the line of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and have the opportunity. And if Nityananda Prabhu is very merciful to us and Gurudev is very merciful, then He'll take away whatever anarthas are there, whatever desire is there for material enjoyment. Vishaya chariya se rase majiya muke bolo hari hari. By taking away our desire for enjoying this material world, se rase majiya, we'll be able to enter into bhakti ras, be able to understand Krishna consciousness, pure Krishna consciousness. And then we will actually be happy in this world. Our hearts will become very soft. Oh, there are so many speakers tomorrow, I will get them shown, especially new sannyasis. Haribo! Vande Guru Vadadam Nang Vakta Vrinda Samanitam Se Chaitanam Prabhum Vande Nittananda Sahoditam Nandanam nang vande radhika charnodham Gopinam samajukta nam prindavana manoharam Sarva Pratham, Asmadiya Guru Pāt Padma Nittulila Pravishtam Kishnu Pāt Ashtotara Satsumad Bhakti Vedanta Shila Vamana Gursi Maharaj Yuvam Om Kishnu Pāt Pariprajag Acharya Varjo Ashtotara Satsumad Bhakti Vedanta Shila Vamana Gursi Maharaj Ke Charan कमलों में अनंत पुरी सत्संग और दंडवाद ज्ञापन करता हूँ तत्पश्चात उपस्थित त्रिदंडी सन्नासी बिंदो मात्र बिंदो 
गौरगत सज्जनवृंद सवार चरणे यथाथ सश्रद्ध धन्यवाद प्रणाम करुणा वरुणारय शिल महाराज हमें आदेश कर प्राप्त नगवान कृपा प्राप्त करा जाए ना से असीम गुरुपाद असीम कृपा मई गुरुपाद पद्मे चरण कम के बार बार स्मरण करी जेखने शुद्ध भक्त से समस्त भक्त तार पीछे पीछे धावित हो आश्चर्य विषय जख ये स्थान आसि अने के अनेक प्रकार हासि मजाक करते लगे कथाय लोक जन था कथाय लोक जन क्यों तो आश्चर्य के विषय जे एखने महाराज आसार संगे संगे प्राय दस हजार लोक कथा देखे एस बस लो ये आश्चर्य के विषय सुने केवल मात्र चैतन्य महाप्रभु जो नाम संकर्तन करत हजार हजार भक्तवृंद चैतन्य महाप्रभुर संगे नाम खोल करताल ने नाम संकर्तन करत केवल मात्र श्रवण करूपे तो अपनारा दर्शन कर महाराज एस हजार हजार लोक कथा के छुटे एलो कथाय समस्त व्यवस्था जिन सुंदर सुचारू होते चल शुद्ध तई नई दैव दुर्योग भगवान जान परीक्षा नीन जा निजे चोखर मध्य दर्शन करलय हार पर महाप्रलय पर आज शुने जो समस्त जीव महाविष्णु के आर आविर्भूत है से हमारे तई देख लहाप्रलय तो गल समस्त ट्रेन सब तो धूलिस्त हो गल सब तो ट्रेन थे बैरिए गल क्योंकि कल आश्चर्य विषय जो अब नवद्वीप धाम परिक्रमा करके मायपुरे पोछल कोथा थे दस हजार व्यक्ति महाराज श्री चरण और महाराज संगे संगे परिणाम करते करते शास्त्र मध्य सुने चैतन्य चंद्र दया कर विचार विचार कर चित्ते पाइबे चमत्कार हम तो बोली ना महाराज विचार कर महाराज दया कर विचार विचार कर चित्ते पाइबे चमत्कार गुरुपाद पद्मे दया गुरुपाद पद्मे कृपा क्या अनुभव करबें बद्धजीव अनुभव करते पासंडी और जरा दुराचारी ये समस्त और गुरुद्रोह अथवा गुरु अपराधी तरा महाराज अहित की कृपा महाराज जो विचार ये समस्त बुझते परे ना तरा अपराधी क्यों क्यों बला वास्तव रूपे तरा बुझते पर भक्तिविनोद ठाकुर जैवधर्म मध्य एक कथा सुंदर भावे जी अपारा जैवधर्म ग्रंथखानी अध्ययन कर जैवधर्म मध्य देखें भक्तिविनोद ठाकुर स्पष्ट रूपे देखे जख जगत मध्य शुद्ध महाभागवत थकें तर प्रकट लीला थे अने के तर महिमा बुझते पर वास्तव जरा बिरोधिता करा महाराज के भूल बुझे अनुगत्य स्वीकार करते एक दिन न एक दिन तुभव कर बुझते पर कत महान तर कत उदारता तर कत उदार चरित्र तरह जो वस्तु देवर जन एस से वस्तु और क्यों देवार मत न भूत न भविष्य विचार कर देख शिल महाराज बार बार को बैष्णव के बोले देखो जो कथागुल देवानंद गौरिय मठे परशु दिन दुई पर आगे महाराज जो समस्त कथा हम तो चैलेंज कर बोलते परि आज पर समस्त कथा बोले केहू बोले नाई जो कथार मध्य श्रीलक्ष्मण दास कविरा चैतन्य चैताम मध्य अनुभूत चरण चिरात करना अवतीर्ण कर ठीक महाराज आज ये समस्त कथागुल व्यक्त कर जगन्नाथपुरी धाम वैशिष्ट शिल महाराज जी सुंदर रूपे 
परिव्यक्त करते करते श्री महाराज जी जिस नवदी धाम महिमा व्यक्त कर रायरबंद संबाद मध्य जिस समस्त कथागुल व्यक्त कर श्री महाराज तरह मान हृदय रूपी अंतर मध्य जिस धन गो आज जन अकातरे सब जन जनसाधारण मध्य जन वितरण कर दीचन किंतु दुर्भागा जी मादृस अधम आधार कर सौभाग्य बोले मन करी अजोग्य के योग्यता प्रदान कर चैतन्य महाप्रभु दयाल कथा श्रवण कर चैतन्य महाप्रभु की उदारता चैतन्य महाप्रभु जी उदारता कत सुंदर तत्मी मन करी चैतन्य महाप्रभु तो उदारत रही तो सत्य है कि गुरुदेव जी उदारता ये उदारतार कथा के वर्णन करते समस्त कथागुल चैतन्य चरितार चैतन्य चरितम चैतन्य चरितमृतर मध्य वर्णन कर महाराज जी मानो निजे के अनुभव कर समस्त से समस्त कथागुल के आज समस्त भक्त बिंदुर मध्य परेशन कर राधिका करजरी मृत्यु समय जान तुम्हार चरण स्मरण करते करते देह जान जन देह पाथ है ये प्रार्थना वंशा हरे कृष्ण कल सकाल कल सकाल आठटार समय सन्यास देा सन्यासर कैंडिडेट नाम घोषणा करा कल सकाल आठटार समय श्री गुरु भजन गुरु उपस्थित हबें सन्यासर पर हरिना एवं दीक्षा जरा हरिना एवं दीक्षा नीबें ता विजय कृष्ण ब्रह्मचारी निकट नाम लिखे दीबें और जरा हरिन दीक्षार जो जरा आगे नहीं ओखे आसार प्रयोजन नहीं ता क्यों ओखे आसे अजथा भीड़ करबें ना जगह अत्यंत छोट और अजथा भीड़ कर ले जरा हरिन दीक्षा नारे तर खूब असुविधा है यह अनुरोध करा केवल हरिन दीक्षा नीबें और सन्यास तार आसबें अन्न के आसबें ना ये हमारे करबद्ध अनुरोध सन्यासर जो सकाले सकाले एखे पार कीर्तन थकबें गुरुदेव कल बिकल बल्ला और अनेक ताड़ी आसबें एक घंटा आगे आसबें सो टूमारो उल भी सन्यास एट ए एम After that, Harinam and Diksha. Only who will take Sunnas and Harinam Diksha? I am requesting them to come here 8 a.m. in Gurudev Bhajan Kuti. Not other person because place is too small. And if you will acquire the place, who will take Harinam and Sunnas and Diksha? Very difficult for them to listen their name and they are talking so much in downstairs. Today face so much difficulties. So I am requesting you all. Then please don't come there without any necessity. Only who will take sannyas and holy name and diksha they will come. The name of sannyas candidate is Upananda Prabhu. Hari Ba. Hari Ba. Sukhananda Prabhu. Hari Ba. Nanda Kishore Prabhu. Hari Ba. Niladri Prabhu. Hari Ba. Sattananda Prabhu. Hari Ba. Damodar Prabhu. Hari Ba. Srinivas Prabhu. आत्मा प्रदीप फ्रॉम रशिया द फ्रेंड ऑफ डॉक्टर सुखदेव आत्मा प्रदीप फ्रॉम रशिया दिस आर विल फॉर सन्नास कैंडिडेट सो आई एम रिक्वेस्टिंग यू ऑल टू कम देयर 8 एम भक्ति विज्ञान भक्ति विज्ञान आल्सो कम देयर ड्यूरिंग सन्नास सेरेमनी सो उपानंद प्रभु सुखानंद प्रभु सत दामोदर प्रभु श्रीनिवास प्रभु नीलाद्री प्रभु सत्यानंद प्रभु 
नंद किशोर प्रभु भक्ति विज्ञान प्रभु विज्ञान महाराज फ्रॉम मॉर्निंग यू शुड ऑल बी हियर आफ्टर आरती और चैतन्य भागवत विल बी रेड एंड ऑल डिवोटिस शुड बी हियर टाइम टू टाइम कीर्तन एंड इन इवनिंग आई विल कम एंड गौ जन मोत्सव विल बी हियर आई प्रे निशिंग देव That he should be pleased to control Indra. Human standard control, nothing they will control. So we pray that he should control Indra Dev and uh, our this last uh, festival, festival should be Madurena Samapai. आज कीर्तन के बाद कुछ ब्रजवा से बस होली कीर्तन करेंगे आरती के बाद और प्रसाद के पहले जो लोग बैठना चाहते हैं बैठ सकते हैं कृष्णदास प्रभु कल सकाल सातटार मध्य महाराज का आसबें कृष्णदास प्रभु कल सकाल सातटार मध्य महाराज खबर आसबें Ramachandra Prabhu can go on the street tomorrow. According to um, Indian tradition, very special festival tomorrow. Of course, we all have come for the appearance of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu celebration, but on the streets everywhere they will throw with colors. It is a very ancient tradition, very special, and we just wanted to inform you that if you go out on the street, this color will not disappear from your clothes, from your hair, from your face. Everywhere they will throw color. So try to avoid that if you want to have a peaceful day tomorrow. Otherwise, you have to tolerate all these things. So don't come out on the streets. Try to avoid as much as possible. Come here early. And stay here at least till one o'clock non-stop. Yeah, tomorrow also fasting, so it is very auspicious. Jamuna chira, panach. 
Hare Krishna. An announcement for everybody who is wishing to go on Puri Paragram with Rasananda Prakula. Those devotees wishing to go, can they please come to the registration office immediately so that we can arrange transportation. So come and see Dina Bandung Prabhu or Akadesh Prabhu. Akadesh.
कारभारी अधिकारी तामर डोला अधिकारी तामर डोला संगाय मुकुंद वाजू बोसे अधिकार वाजू बोसे राहन करे मैंने ताई जरा गोर बोले वाजू बोसे राहन करे मधुर 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 बाजे संकाजंता घोर दरता मधुर 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 बाजे
दुर्गिता गिरधर जो श्री राधा विनोद बिहारी जो संध्यार त्रिकीला प्रविष्ट विष्णुपाद अष्टोत्तर सद श्री कृष्ण मधुभक्ति त्रिरूप सिद्धांति गोस्वामी महाराज की जय जय रुतलीला प्रविष्ट विष्णुपाद अष्टोत्तर सद श्री कृष्ण मधुभक्ति प्रज्ञान केशव गोस्वामी महाराज की जय मितलीला ब्रह्मिष्ट मिश्रुवाद अष्टोदर सदा श्री सिस्टर मधुभक्ति विदांत बामन वस्तामी महाराज की परिप्राज का आचार जितर दर्नीश कामी सिस्टर मधुभक्ति विदांत नारायण वस्तामी महाराज की जय अन्य अन्य त्रिदंडी पादिगण की जय मितलीला ब्रह्मिष्ट मिश्रुवाद सिस्टर मधुभक्ति विदांत वस्तामी महाराज की जय जय मितलीला ब्रह्मिष्ट मि� सरस्वती गोस्वामी प्रभु पाद की जय मिथिला प्रभुशील भक्ति वेदांत अन्य श्रद्धी पाद गण की जय माँ भगवत श्रीला गौर की श्रद्धा स्वामी वाज महाराज की जय सचिदान श्रील भक्ति विनो ठाकुर की जय वैष्णव सार्वभौम श्रीला जगन्नाथ दस स्वामी वाज महाराज की जय जय श्री रूप सनातन भट्ट रघुनाथ श्री जीव गोपाल भट्टदास रघुनाथ ए सड़क स्वामी प्रभु की जय राम आचार्य श्री हरिदास ठाकुर की जय प्रेम से गौ श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नित्यानंद श्री अद्वैत गदाधर श्रीवास श्री गौर भक्त वृंद की जय राय राम नंद सर्वुदा मदरादि गौर पार्षद वृंद की जय नरोत्तम श्यामानंद श्रीनिवास प्रभु त्रय की जय हरिनाम संकीर्तन की जय भक्त विपुल सिद्धेन की जय गंगा यमुना सरस्वती जी की जय चारि धाम चारि संप्रदाय चारि आचार की जय जय श्री लगरुड़ देव की जय जय श्री प्रहलाद महाराज निशिंग देव की जय श्री गोविंद गोपीनाथ मदन मुखी जी की जय राधा रमण राधा श्याम सुंदर राधा कुलानंद राधा दामोदर की जय जय श्रीमान चैतन्य महाप्रभु की जय तदीय अभिभावर अधिवास तिथि की जय अनंत कोटि गौरु भक्त वृंद की जय समागत गौरु भक्त वृंद की जय
So it is a uh, corporate name, March 25th, 2004. We're at Sridham Navadweep. And uh, soon Maharaj will get his name from Gurudev. Amiram. Jai Maharaj. So, it's a little auspicious day. Yes, very auspicious. Mm. Say anything yet, Ma Maharaj? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ex Maharaj. Maharaj. As yet unknown. When did you choose Yati Maharaj? What is it? Yati. Yati, Yati. Yati means Sanyasi. Yeah. Yati. That's a good one. Actually, so. Yati. Yati Maharaj. Yeah. Name the names, Maharaj. Maybe you have to die. Shukti Harijan. Harijan. Huh? What is it? Brihad. Brihad. Bhati. Vlati. With a V. Brihad Bhati. There's supposed to be 108 of them, huh? Do you want a barber? You also want to shave now? Huh? Mm -hmm. You want to shave? Mmm, maybe my... They're going to bring a barber, maybe we should... Oh, really? Yeah. You're going to shave also?